Hi, I'm Chris Hoff with Printistat. I'm technical sales here. What I'd like to go over with you today is connecting a Carlson BRX7 to a tablet using Carlson Serve PC. All right, we have our uh, Serve PC software on our Carlson RT3. And this is going to be the same as accepts if you were using this with uh, Serve CE on like a Carlson Surveyor 2 or, or something similar. So uh, what we'll do here first is we'll go into GPS Rover. And they have all these manufacturers down in here. So what we'll go to is Carlson. And then those beeps you heard was the uh, right before I started the video, I turned on our Carlson BRX7 and that was just an initial startup sounds. So I'll scroll up here to Carlson. And what we're going to go through is the Carlson BRX7. So it's selected here. What we'll go to is comms. And we're going to use a Bluetooth connection. And the Bluetooth type is Windows Mobile. So we'll hit the wrench and sprockets and find device. So what this is going to do is look for our BRX7 and possibly anything else that, that might be able to connect to it. All right, so found a whole bunch of uh, stuff here in our, in our showroom. So what we're going to do is just verify. I'll verify real quick the serial number on the bottom of the BRX7. And this one is definitely it. So highlight it, hit the green check. And what we have to do next, some people forget this step, is we'll have to bond the Bluetooth. So I already see the Bluetooth light is ready to go. So this air just comes up is because the BRX7 has a uh, pole tilt uh, compensation. I just haven't done this yet. I just pulled it out of the box. So. Uh, Look for further videos on how to do that process uh, in the future. All right, so now we'll tab over to receiver. And that's our BRX7. We're at two meters. And what I'd like to hear, do here is just verify our satellites. Uh, I like to run it on silent. Some people prefer uh, having it talk to you. I'd like the silent. Uh, that's just what I'm used to. And then we're not going to store any raw data here, so that's unchecked. Uh, definitely enable SureFix. I uh, recommend that uh, to get your highest level of accuracy in the field. And we'll go over here to Configure Constellations. And it's using so GPS, Beidou, GLONASS, and Galileo. So perfect. And I'll just hit the green check to accept it. And then the next page is RTK. So look for a video in the future here on the next part uh, where I'll show you how to connect it as a network rover. Um, but what I like to do last is just uh, bond it with Bluetooth just to be sure again. So now it's going to go check. Another error came up just because just verifying that we haven't uh, done the pole calibration yet, but that's fine. We'll do that later. All right. Well, thanks for watching. I hope you learned something today. Uh, but if you have more questions than what we covered here or uh, want to learn something else, uh, we'll have more videos in the future or you can contact us directly. Uh, one, num one way is our phone number. It's 1-800-811-9889. Uh, you can also go to our website at printostat.com or you can even send uh, myself an email. It's survey at printostat.com. So thanks, and uh, let me know if you have any questions.